Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for December 3rd. This is just what I'm picking up on December 3rd. It will resonate whenever it resonates for whoever it's meant to resonate with. This is for all signs. I focus on relationships. We'll see whatever comes up, but then again, this is not a private reading, so keep that in mind. It may be for you or may not be. Tomorrow's might be the one for you. You never know. This is just an energy I'm picking up on today. I want to thank you all for the uh, uh, 100,000 subscribers. If you missed the live last night, my thank you. I'm here to say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So, I did a live last night, if you want to go check that out. <laughs> the truth. truth somebody this is the truth There's something some kind of truth is coming out somebody's either waking up you know they're accepting the truth or somebody is communicating the truth interesting mm. after they've been you know somebody hasn't had the courage Lack of courage, fear holding them back. Now, this is somebody that may not be able to control themselves, control their anger at times. Interesting. Let's see what, what's happening. Oh! Queen of Pentacles reversed. Well, this is a person that is possessive, jealous, ungrounded. This could also be a lost opportunity because she's in reversed. It's a lost opportunity for abundance and security, perhaps with this person. Maybe this person didn't, he took too long, and now he's lost this opportunity. I don't know. I don't know. Could go, it could go many different ways, right? Ooh! Mmm, the devil. The devil. The devil got in the way. The ego, devil's ruled by ego. Yeah, ego does get in the way. Absolutely. It's a shame. It really is a shame. Especially when there's such a bond here. There's such a tie. So somebody is probably karmically tied to a person. There's a deep, deep, deep attraction. Deep attraction. But that ego has really impaired the connection. <laughs> this is also a card of temptation. Somebody is tempted, tempted to do so, or they were tempted. They, oh, the devil brings in bad decisions. Interesting. This is seeing the truth about something, a connection, that probably is lost now. Ah, uh, yeah. Ooh, oh God. Yes, yeah, somebody has been in denial trying to avoid this truth. Oh my God. Trying to avoid this truth. Wearing a mask, pretending. Because of ego. 
trying to escape, probably, you know, hiding the truth with addictions. So, yeah, somebody's been in denial and now they're, they, they have to make a painful, distressful decision. Am I ready? Am I ready to take this mask off? And speak my truth. Speak the truth. The whole truth and nothing but the truth. Am I going to keep letting fear get in the way? Because this opportunity is... Oh God, it's like... Gone. You can't fight gravity. If you don't take it, it's gone. But there's such a bond, right? There's a really, really huge, huge bond in which it's undeniable. The bond is undeniable and somebody has tried to deny the bond, right? I've tried to deny this bond. Pretend it's not there. Bury it with addictions and lies and, you know... But the truth is, somebody wants happiness. They want the abundance, they want the security, they want the stability, and there's an opportunity for that, that's a ten of, ten of cups, extreme happiness. The truth about who they love, somebody is pro may tell the truth because they want that happiness. They may sp communicate that, you know, they want to spend Christmas with you. And the fucking cat. Excuse my language. I love my cats, by the way, just so you know. And they are allowed to sleep on the bed. Even though they don't very much, but they're allowed to. Anyhow, somebody is... Giving up, giving up on their fear by the looks of things. I feel like somebody is going to communicate about their, their desires to be happy, to have that, that family, to have that togetherness, okay? Somebody now appreciates with this three of coins, they now appreciate something that they lost because this is a lost opportunity in reverse it absolutely is they see that there's a lot of abundance here the nine of pentacles somebody's doing very 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 well on their own with the nine of coins this is the independent person very abundant she's got the money in her hand and all around her i'm good i'm happy i'm content i'm rich from within which makes me rich on the outside as well. This person is doing great on their own. And it looks as though somebody now appreciates what they lost. And they wasted their time. This is wasted time wearing a mask. Somebody wasted their time pretending and now they have an opportunity to communicate. Or they may communicate. Maybe they finally realize, they appreciate the opportunity that has been lost. And it's like, now they, they've got to see what's mirroring each other. This person has given up on the connection. Somebody has given up on the connection because of ego. In addictions and lies. And it looks like this person is like, I'm not going to waste my time anymore. This person's not going to waste their time waiting for some sort of ship to come in that's going backwards, going in the other direction. It's headed out. So we have a situation here in which somebody, you know, this is a, 
toxic situation. It looks to me like somebody has allowed themselves to be tempted by some sort of toxic situation, whether it, whether it be addictions or sex on the side or whatever. Somebody has been tempted by the devil, an ego, for attention, for whatever reason. It could go so many ways. Somebody has been tempted and somebody else has decided to not waste their time on this lie. It has absolutely been a lie. And somebody has wasted their time by lying. By pretending that they didn't want this happiness. Because the truth is they do. They do. Somebody really wants this, you know, before Christmas, before Christmas. This reminds me of Christmas. Looks like Christmas to me. Anyway, we're going to get some more cards here. But I feel like you could or somebody could be receiving some sort of communication because somebody can't deny the truth anymore. They've been trying to deny the truth. And now they're, they, it's time to make that stressful decision. about facing your fears and somebody hasn't been able to face their fears trying to escape it you know burying them but now this opportunity that wasn't appreciated is slipping away it's it's pretty I think it's gone okay because it's been too late somebody didn't didn't they took too long they wasted their time living in denial Absolutely. Somebody wastes their time being in denial, trying to avoid the truth, not wanting to face the demons. Seriously, somebody, see the mass demons, somebody did not want to face their demons because of ego. And now the golden opportunity is probably going to be given to somebody who appreciates it by the looks of things. This is a card of appreciation, uh, working together, compromise, and communication. Somebody is going needing to or they are going to release their fear. Because the Knight of the Knight of Swords upright is a courageous knight. He rushes in. In reverse, this guy is fearful. He doesn't dare to. This releasing fear. I want my happiness. And somebody has released this connection because they weren't appreciated. I'm happy on my own. You wasted your time. It's been released. This person, nine's about closure, has closed the door. I am so good on my own. I'm good. I'm not wasting my time. So it looks as though some sort of communication is going to come in because somebody is perhaps on the verge of taking that mask off and facing their demons of some sort. Interesting. Mmm. Ten of Swords. Somebody has kept themselves trapped, tied up. See, he's tied up. He's in shackles. Imprisoned. He is imprisoned. Yeah. Absolutely. It's 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 hell on earth, right? Still in prison. Living a lie right here. Living a lie. This is this is betrayal. Punishment. Living a lie.
puts you in your own prison. You put yourself in your own prison by living a lie, by letting ego drive. When you could have abundance, sad situation. It's, it's, this is a completion. If you break free, I mean, this is about breaking free. It's a 10, it's a completion. There's an opportunity to take the mask off and break out of your own prison, your own mental prison by facing your demons, facing your fears. Seriously. Somebody is keeping themselves in a mental prison. When it's time to stand up and fight for what you want. Fight for what you want. Stand up for yourself. Go after what you want. Even if you're faced with some conflict, this is uh, the Page of Swords, this is a person who sometimes bites off more than they can chew because they, they speak without thinking or um, they cause conflict. And I think that you're, so whoever this is for is afraid of conflict. Afraid that they will get not get the response that they're hoping for. Somebody may have heard a message or heard something about another person that didn't settle very well. It didn't settle very well. And now they're thinking about coming clean with the truth because it hit them right in the gut. Yeah. They've been released. There's been they've been released. Somebody has been released. And again, I mean, this is lack of awareness. Somebody wasn't aware. Lack of somebody was not aware of how happy they could be with another person. This lack of awareness. Refusing to wake up. Lack of forgiveness as well. Holding on to something. Not revealing the truth. Somebody has not revealed the truth for a long time. And it's because of fear. No shit. Somebody wants another chance. That's what this is called, reconciliation. Even I can see that somebody wants another chance. But their fears of being rejected. Their fears of dealing with conflict. You know, I'm really scared to communicate because this conflict you know yeah there's going to be some you know especially if somebody you know made the wrong decision you know the devil whispered in their ear and they followed that road and now that there's a price to pay there is absolutely a price to pay so but they've been living in a mental prison because they did do that because they listened to the wrong sign so um yeah, it looks to me like somebody wants another chance and they fear that they won't get one. So they they are wanting to communicate, but they're thinking about it. They're iffy. Um, they want this happiness. They want it. They want the, the uh, you know, reconciliation, hopefully by Christmas time, by the looks of things. This is absolutely Christmas time. I don't care what anybody says. I know that it is. Okay, somebody would like a reconciliation by Christmas time, but in order to get that reconciliation, they're going to have to stop just watching. We got somebody here who's watching. They're watching and they're lurking behind the scenes and they're watching all the time, but they aren't communicating because they're weak. They're weak. But now the opportunity is slipping away because... somebody is able to step out of their own mental prison and go after the golden opportunity. So 
this is what I see here. Um, somebody took too long. Somebody did, and this person probably knows it. You know, they were they didn't deal with their demons. They they didn't. They let their they let their own thoughts betray themselves. You know, self sabotage. Now the ship has probably sailed away. Anyway, it looks as though today I am getting a message that somebody would like a reconciliation before Christmas. You know, they want to spend Christmas together with you and the cat. And um, they fear rejection, but they've been watching. They've been watching and they may decide to come after you. They may decide to come after you. No, you can say, you know what, all the rest of you back up. All the rest of you back up because this one's mine. You know, because there's other, there's other, look at them all. Look at all the options here. There's some, somebody is like, you know what, back up, boys. This one's mine. This abundance is mine. So we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Capricorn, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, again. Um, so, so far, we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. We have Scorpio here as well. But we have all the signs. I mean, you could say the Ten of Cups with Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And then for fire, we have fire here too. So we have them all. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So we have everybody here. Somebody has is needing, or they're in the process of making that stressful painful decision to face their fears that's what this card is because their fears have kept them imprisoned so somebody wants a reconciliation by the holidays but the only way they're going to get it is to go after what they want with the truth and stop wearing the mask. This person is really lurking behind the scenes. But right now they're cowardly. I'm sorry, but they are. We have a coward here. And because of their cowardly acts, the door is closed or it's closing. It's done. I, we can't be waiting for a coward. There's no reconciliation for somebody that is weak. So, yeah, I feel like we have an energy here where somebody is really deeply connected to another person. Like, I mean, this is like a connection beyond words, okay? It really is. These two people are bound together. It's like they're, they are. They have some sort of karmic contract that needs to be dealt with or whatever. Okay? These two people, they're chained together. They are. It's, it's meant, it's like a bond that needs to be dealt with. Okay? So we have this karmic bond here in which somebody needs to fight for it because it looks as though it's slipping away. And I think that whoever needs to fight for it, knows that it's slipping away or it's gone because you can't fight gravity. You can't fight gravity. You can't fight something that is upside down. You can't. If it's, if it's not realistic you know what I mean if it's dissatisfying if this person is not if it's not being accepted if so if it's not being accepted it's gonna go away to somebody who appreciates it and wants to work together absolutely absolutely so I feel as though um
there's probably going to be some sort of communication that comes through in regards to Oh, let's get one more card. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I want this opportunity. I want this opportunity. And, you know, this, but this is out of control. This is like... There, he's got the script in his hand. It is part of the script. It absolutely is part of the script. But anyway... There's some sort of message that is going to come through from this person who was manipulative and controlling and they're angry and they're upset. And I think maybe they are ready to give up, hopefully, and come with something solid. This person is probably, because this is in reverse, but this is an angry, um, miserable individual. Loss of concentration, loss of focus. They may come through and say, you know, <laughs> poor, poor, pitiful me. Now they, now they want an, an opportunity. Somebody is coming towards you with a golden opportunity. And you may have to make a choice between two. Okay, because we, we have a couple options here. We absolutely do. Somebody that has been delaying coming forward may be at your door with something in their hand. Now, this person right here is very loyal, genuine. Kind. And he's got a solid opportunity. Somebody is coming forward with a solid opportunity. And this person may be angry that there's another person. And they see that. <laughs> oh, jeez, I'm crow. And now they, they better shit or get off the pot because there's more than just one person. There's several for whoever this is for. So anyway, there's a there's a message or somebody has received some some word that whoever it is that they're losing, they are really losing. And now they have to make a decision to either tell the truth or stay in prison. So yeah, this is what I have. I feel like there's an energy of communication coming through in regards to I want to be with you. I want to be with you. I want to I want to I want to have this happiness. Um whether it's somebody new or somebody old, somebody is communicating that they want to spend the holidays with you after they have been fearful. <coughs> they have been fearful about being rejected. And now they, they're like, you know what, I need to go get what is mine before somebody else does. So, whether this is new or old, you know, there could this could be the old because this is a card of reconciliation, but it's reversed. Somebody wants one, but they didn't tell the truth and they didn't wake up for so long. And now they probably are awake because they've heard something. You know, they've received their wake up call and, and now you know they know that they need to they need to they need to get moving. They need to protect what's theirs or go get what's theirs or fight for what they want or lose it. Lose it. This is a card of ego as well. Big ego, huge. So, I guess that's all I have for today.
We have somebody here that's not wasting their time. I'm good. Goodbye. We have other people that see that this person is good. And they're like, I'll take that. And then we have this other person who doesn't want that other person to take that. That's what this story is. So I don't know who this is for. It's not going to resonate with everybody. Somebody is happily abundant on their own. Doing great. Somebody's watching. They have a lot of opportunities. And it's like, nope, this one's mine. And somebody is needing to step out of their own prison. Isn't there a song like that, My Own Prison? And face their fears before this ship is out of sight. Because it's, it's still in sight, but it's like pretty soon it's going to be out of sight. So, yeah, that's what I have. Good luck.